know it's very funny. You probably see him in Toys R Us. God, make some noise for Rashad for sure, guys. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing? You look like you ain't getting with all. You eating chicken with two fingers, you ain't smacking or nothing. You ever seen yeah, yo, you know exactly what I'm talking about because you from Texas. You see the no, you from Texas. I'm from Texas. Oh, you from Texas, so you know exactly what the fuck I'm talking about. Like, yo, this shit like good right here, good. Let's take a right my good, good right here, child. What the hell? I like the I like the eHarmony couple wall right here. This is great. Yo, this dude is tan and shit. Where did y'all meet? Mismatch.com? Where did y'all meet? <laughs> oh my god, we got Malibu's most wanted over here in this corner right here. This, these parkour motherfuckers right here, goddamn it. I mean, goddamn, I feel good, girl. Save me a goddamn. You ate all your chicken. Now, that's a real black woman right there. She peeled them right off the bone. Nice. I love it. I love it. Yes. My name is Rashad Bashir. I am Khalid Rachman. Middle fucking name, okay? Khalid Rashad Bashir Rachman. He got a full fucking Muslim name, goddammit. I can tell you I got a Muslim name because when I go to the deli in my neighborhood, as soon as they hear my name, they give me everything free. As soon as I go, Rashad Bashir, Salama Lego, how you doing, my friend? Please bring a phone for them. Salama No, you're not going to pay anything. Here, get a free can of soda out of the refrigerator. Uh, cool, man. Thank you so much. You're so wonderful. <laughs> No idea. I do not have five dollars for this guy. Oh my god. Yes, I live in the hood, okay? Don't fucking judge me, alright? We in the basement, alright? Don't fucking judge me. All here eat nasty ass wings, okay? I mean, most of us, but all of you, you got some nachos uh, about to get some of those right there. I feel good. I should use, I'm sorry, I should use the bathroom before I came over here. I gotta take shit. Hard! Oh my god. I, I, look, I don't know about y'all, like, we're black people, we can't use the bathroom everywhere. Like, we'll go home first. Like, we'll be, we're living in Harlem. We're coming from Brooklyn. We're gonna hold that shit. Oh my god. I don't know, hey, anyone ever had to use the bathroom, but they fought it and a little bit came out? You know what I mean? in places I don't care about. I you look, you ever took a shit at your job like it was your last day? <laughs> you know exactly. You ever took a doodle like you was about to quit, man? I've been sitting on the toilet. Now, here's the bad part. My toilet and my, my job is a little space right there so people can see your feet so they know who it is. They're like, yeah, that's the job with them transforming shit. That's him with them busted ass needles right there. They're like, what you doing? I'm like, dropping off my references. You ever get religious? He's like, oh, praise Jesus. Oh, my God. took your shit so hard, your feet pike up like that. Woo, <laughs> 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 feel good, man. I had Indian food. Anybody had Indian food? A, do you know where good Indian food spot is, or do you know? No, you're not even Indian. You're just mysterious. I think that was, <laughs> He looked cool. He looked brown, but he got white people here. I like it. I like it. <laughs> cool, man. I had Indian food. If, for those who've never had Indian food, let me tell you exactly what it is. Indian food looks like the end result after you eat Indian food, okay? That's what it looks like. That's what it looks like. I swear to God. Not as true. It's true stuff. I'm sorry. I know. Look, you finish your food. Shut up. You ain't even finished your food. inside the tray, it looks disgusting, but tastes great. Like, I don't took a shit, and I didn't, like, I don't know, like, when I had Indian food and I shit it out, I don't know whether I ate it or I dropped it. I didn't know. I looked at the toilet, it was just chickpeas, corn, spinach, rice, and lettuce. I was, I was like, what the fuck did I have, man? Oh, my goodness, man. Shit, that's why I gotta go out. I gotta go out and eat. I gotta, if I'm going to eat, I eat at home. But if I'm going out eating anywhere, I'm going out with big ones. Clapping up big girls in here. All right, good talk, good talk. Good. Just because it's talk don't mean I'm gonna point your ass out. That's all the fuck I'm saying. 
question. I'm sorry. I'm a, I'm a skinny dude. Look, I don't mean to bash big women. I love big women, okay? I don't know about uh, these other skinny dudes, these white dudes in here. They got all the Asian girls. I know. It's cool. It's cool. I'm different. You know, you know why I like big girls? Because we were the outcasts in high school, okay? We the outcasts. I was skinny. I had a gap in my teeth. I still got one. But I got a gap in my teeth. I didn't know how to dress. She smelled like McDonald's. So it was like a match made in heaven. <laughs> She had snacks. That's what it, that's what it went down to. We're judging like a motherfucker right here with that damn peppermint shirt you got on. I swear to God, don't do that, man. I don't know if any of you ever in here hugged a big girl. You ever hugged your aunt? Like, I don't know if she's big enough. Like, I hug my aunt all the time. You ever hugged a big girl? They feel amazing. A big girl, she feel like hot laundry in a bag. You just hug. <laughs> I was like, fuck that, we going out. Let's go there, they give us a menu, we sit down. I'm like, girl, get whatever you want. I was like, what you want? She said, I want page two through six. I was like, what? <laughs> there was two pages on my goddamn menu. I don't know where she got this Bible of food from. I don't know where she got that shit. I love women, period, man. I love women. But now it's summertime. You ever see the haircuts that these girls be getting? You ever see the chick that got her hair cut on this side, but she keep the rest of that shit over here? What type of shit is that? I'm just saying, if you're going to commit to chemo, commit. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. You ever see how she, you ever see how she look like on, like on this side? She look like Beyonce. Like one night she was hanging out with her friends, they got drunk, and then they got into a cab, and she rolled down the window and stuck her head out the window <laughs> and yelled, turn down for what? And a bunch just came by and scalped the shit out of her. She's like, turn down for Man, yo, I'm about, to, I'm about to have a heart attack. I gotta sit down for a second. I, you know, can I can I talk to y'all for a second? I got a couple fears, man. I got all this energy and shit, but I gotta tell y'all something. I got, I got, it's just this one big fear. I got, I got this uh, big fear of dying. It's not the fact that I don't want to die. It's just that when I do, I want my funeral to be the shit. You ever been to a funeral like the person in the casket, everybody crying, flowers everywhere, all that shit? No. When I die, I don't want to be laid out in the casket with my eyes closed and people crying over me. Hell no. I'm gonna be sitting up looking right at you. <laughs> 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 